Hey, how's it going? Good, that's good to hear. As you probably know, I'm Wade. Uh, and my intern, Alex, and I run a little thing called The Sports Phil. I think I'm a better intern. And um, uh, if you watched the recent video uh, by my intern, Alex, he talked about immigration a little bit. And I want to piggy, I want to piggyback off that a little bit and uh, talk about something that goes right along with that, and uh, that is migration, which is the latter of the word immigration. Migration, in and of itself, is its own idea and uh, term that I think we need to explore a little bit to fully grasp the idea of immigration and how we should approach it as a political topic. Um, First off, what is migration, <laughs> right? Uh, if you look at Webster's Dictionary, it'd probably say something like a seasonal movement by perhaps m most commonly birds, but also some other animals as well. Uh, but what I bet you probably didn't know is there's uh, long distance migrations by uh, swallows and uh, the, the, the northern, uh, northern pintails which are uh, very beautiful, uh, known for their gorgeous uh, tails. And a lot of other birds of prey, and they, and they like to travel long distances uh, for reasons unknown. They just say, hey, I need to change the scenery, you know? Let me get the heck out of here, because uh, something's fishy in uh, Dodge, as the old saying goes. <clears throat> I think I got a bird. You got a bird? For the video. Cat bird! And, um... Well, what else? What else are we talking about here? Uh, oh, why, why, why would they migrate? Uh, why would they? Why would they migrate? You Tell know them why. Uh, the days are starting to get a little longer. You know, it's getting a little colder. When it gets a little colder, things don't come out as much. You know what I'm saying? Food gets a little more scarce. Okay? And they start to see all this stuff year in and year out. So what do they do? They hightail it. They hightail it right down to a northern, uh, a little, a little higher climate that's a little warmer. You know why didn't? I actually think of that. Um, and then, uh, see, this, this happens mainly only in the northern hemisphere. Because, uh, we have much more drastic seasonal changes. Uh, and the thing about, you understand about birds is, they're much smarter than us. They don't just say, oh, hey, it's winter, I have a calendar, no. They, they, they read celestial cues. Like the Earth's magnetic field, they uh, they look at uh, well, the position of the sun, the stars in the sky. They're they're much smarter than you give them credit for. How does this tie back into uh, immigration? You might ask. Let's break it down one more time. M. Immigration. I'm. Migration. Thanks, bud. Thanks for watching, you guys. You want me to do it? That was good. Yeah, you might as well. Will you press?